WTFNN. Headline News Update. And welcome to the 2 p.m. update with me, David White, here at TFNN. Uh, what do we have? Well, we had uh, kind of a little bit of a bounce. There was uh, a great deal of uh, this was based on some rumors out of China and, of course, uh, employment numbers this morning. But I really think that, uh, you know, the huge bounce uh, over in China, which was uh, a, a rumor that I think kind of started to fall flat uh, and uh, why we were up fairly strongly uh, early in the morning and then uh, turned around so hard uh, is uh, heard that there were some comments that uh, maybe uh, the cart was before the horse on some of that. Uh, of course, uh, the big mover out here is crude up uh, 4%, over 4.4%. Uh, gold uh, on its heels up uh, 2.86%. And probably the Biggest, uh, well, there's two things that were really interesting, and we'll talk about those on the show. Uh, but the first one is uh, I've always complained about the volume not being uh, all that exciting or just on the margins, maybe 5% uh, to 10% higher or lower. Uh, but we're going to have a big volume day. Uh, we've got uh, 2. Point, uh, well, let's call it two and a quarter billion shares as we start the show today. And that is something we haven't had for a while. So we'll see how we close the end of the day. Options have been kind of bullish uh, until uh, we got the, uh, the boom dropped on us. Most people probably not sailors and remember the nautical reference there, but uh, certainly a great deal of that. So um, other things that we have going on, of course, uh, I'll get to that here. Uh, midterms uh, on Tuesday, uh, I don't know if the market's going to move uh, that much. It doesn't happen, uh, but uh, every four years. And, of course, you get the general election every two years or every four years, too. But uh, not exactly sure if there's going to be some worries in that or indecisions. Uh, as I said, uh, uh, volume is pretty good. And lastly, uh, watch out uh, China rumors about them reopening and maybe getting off the zero tolerance COVID plan uh, are floating around. So maybe something on Monday when we return. See you in a minute. The reality is that navigating financial markets can be risky. Markets can be chaotic and difficult to understand. <laughs> 